Residents of Wrightsville Beach, North Carolina, are scrambling to get their boats safely stowed away as powerful Hurricane Irene takes aim at the eastern seaboard. What are your thoughts that this could be an area hit hard? It just would be devastation. Kay Minnick and Jean Ann Sutton remember 1954, the last time their beloved beach town took a direct hit. Hurricane Hazel, a Category 4, ripped their tiny community apart. Water was just pouring into the store, all over everything. It was horrible, just horrible. Irene is expected to stay a major hurricane as it gets closer to the U.S., and tens of millions of people live in its potential path. The storm is forecast to brush the outer banks of North Carolina sometime late Friday night. Some evacuations are already underway, and the state's governor is warning everyone to prepare for the worst. Pray real hard that North Carolina will be fine. Irene is then expected to continue up the East Coast, threatening New Jersey, New York, and even New England. We have a blocking high over the Atlantic, and that's going to mean a pathway for the storm to go north. Right now, the chance for it to go out to sea looks pretty low, so everybody needs to be prepared. They may have to take some hurricane preparations by this weekend. Forecasters warn Irene could cause flooding and power outages along the East Coast as far north as Maine, even if it stays offshore. Karen Brown, CBS News, Wrightsville Beach, North Carolina.